it's, it's a real sad day, you know, because Dave was, you know, he was so highly thought of, uh, so highly respected, great fella, comedian, lovely to be around. You know, it's, it still hasn't really sunk in because he, he's a good, great friend to us all, and we're, we're very close, we're very clannished as, as the next group of players because. You know, for years we've, we've met doing hospitality for for the club uh, before a half time during the game and at the end of the game where we have a beer or two. Uh, and Dave was always the centre of attraction, you know, just rubbing off. And he's going to be really sorely missed. You know, he hasn't been well for some time, but he's still been turned up for games because he, he played for Everton and Liverpool, but his passion was Liverpool. He was a massive Liverpool fan and uh, didn't like missing the game. Uh, yeah, it's a sad day for, for, the, for, the, for, for, the, for the club, you know, and the ex-players in particular. But for his family, you know, I thought uh, with his family massively because he'll leave, he'll leave a huge hole for all of us. Very good. Excellent player, you know. I remember from his Ipswich days, I actually went there to watch Liverpool play Ipswich six hours on the train. We got beat 1-0 at... The doc either made the goal or scored the goal for Ipswich. I'll never forgive him for that. Uh, brilliant for Ipswich, brilliant for Everton. But for Liverpool, he, he probably didn't get the, the credit he deserved because of the great players like Kenny was around and Rushy and all these players, you know. But he's brilliant. Goals per game ratio and he's got the medals to prove it.